I'm honored to be able to tell you a little bit about Jack Koash and his many contributions to CSU Bakersfield. Jack was one of the original founders of CSUB. He arrived when the campus was just a wide open field. And he served as the Dean of Sciences and later as the Dean of the College of Arts and Sciences until his retirement in 1987, after 19 years of working at CSUB. In addition to his administrative duties, he taught every year and he delighted in taking geology students out into the field to show them the many geological features in the region. Before he arrived at CSUB, Jack served in the Army Signal Corps overseas. And later, uh, he received his PhD from Yale and he taught for 17 years at Bowling Green State University. And it was there that the National Science Foundation recognized his accomplishments and talents and hired him as a supervisor for their summer program for teachers in India. And after being there uh, in that program, uh, the National Science Foundation hired him uh, to work in Washington, DC, where their headquarters are. And it was from there that Jack was hired to come out to Bakersfield to help found this new state college. According to Jack, they only had two years to build, to put the curricula together, to hire faculty, and to recruit students. And you can imagine how much work that must have been, how stressful that was, and with the fate of the college and the university at stake. But with Jack's international experience and his work ethic, he was up to the challenge. And while Jack was at CSUB, he founded the School of Science, later the School of Arts and Sciences, and he also founded the Department of Geological Sciences, as well as the California Well Sample Repository. For those of you who don't know what that is, the, the repository remains the only facility in California that provides permanent storage of geological samples and data for the public. It still serves as a major resource for academic research, for governmental regulation agencies, for industry, and it is one of the campus's main connections to the community. And Jack was the founding director in 1975. He was also instrumental in establishing degree programs at the bachelor's level and master's level in geology. And after he retired, Jack continued to contribute in many different ways to CSUB in the community. Jack Koash made impactful, long-lasting contributions to CSUB and the community. Sadly, in March 2019, Jack passed away and we miss him. We owe Jack a sincere debt of gratitude for his dedicated service in building successful, thriving programs and institutions from scratch. His instrumental role in transforming CSUB from a vacant field into a thriving university and his founding of a successful school, undergraduate and graduate programs and a major community resource make Jack Koash very worthy of the CSUB Faculty Hall of Fame. Thanks.